Um, and then we needed to support ourselves with food, so we agriculture, we did it just like England, where with sheep and wheat and you know maize and so we grew crops and, and sheep um, very quickly with our sheep we realized the dingoes were eating them all mm. so we've got a problem we've got a problem with a wild dog going around killing all our sheep and this doesn't happen in mother england mm -hmm. so uh, what they did is this is their main agricultural area at the time they built in the 1880s this huge fence it's called the dog fence and a lot of australians don't even know we got it but it's this massive fence, it's five and a half thousand kilometres long, about six foot tall, and it's designed to keep the dingo away from our agricultural area. Oh, wow. This is the food bowl of Australia, but also where 95% of Australians live. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So what we've done unintentionally to save our farming industry, our sheep, we've taken the predator for the kangaroo away. Mm. So here, the kangaroos in here, are up to 10 times the population they are in here yeah. because there's no predator. Yeah. 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 So we've created a predator ourselves. Yeah. We're part, we've made the problem yeah. by basically an animal that's designed to be on the lookout for dingoes all the yeah. time now basically just say, hey, let's just keep yeah. having a family. Yeah. And that's yeah. what they do. Um, and being our main agricultural area, we've chopped down most of the forest to create open pasture for our livestock exactly what kangaroos yeah. need mm. yeah. and we pump water from underground like Danny was saying so there's a lot more surface water yeah. happy days keep on having a family mm. no dingoes to kill us and they yeah but also that the people's perceptions now you've got most of Australia's population here is kangaroos are too many mm. because they're only seeing in their backyard yeah out here like we were here in Alice Springs on the other side of the fence and all I come from Western Australia um, there's no hunting allowed in this area. It can't be justified because there's a dingo yeah. killing, keeping everything level. Yeah. 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 Here, wherever you go, you see bloody kangaroos in the mm. Blue Mountains yeah. or yeah. golf courses or picnic grounds are everywhere. everywhere. So we need professional hunters to go in to the farming areas in mm. particular. If you're a farmer, you may have a thousand sheep and you may have 10,000 kangaroos. Mm. And the kangaroos come out of the forest, which is not yours, in the middle of the night, they jump over the fence or slip under it, yeah. um, the, the fence that keeps the sheep in, your sheep, they come in and they're eating 500, half a kilo of grass a night, 5,000 kangaroos, <laughs> um, 10,000 kangaroos, mm. equal out to be 5,000 eating a kilo, that's five tonnes of grass a night you're losing mm. to an animal you get nothing out of. So you quickly call in a professional shooter mm, right, okay. and he takes the 10,000 away mm. and you can profit again. That's how it works. Yeah. So